Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Nasir Sof. In this video, I am going to show you how you can fix the XAMPP MySQL common error that is MySQL shut down unexpectedly. Okay, uh, this error message basically popping up uh, after some uh, time in my computer. Okay, and I have some important database inside my XAMPP. And if you are basically worried about to the database is data so don't worry in this video i will uh, show it to you how you you can fix this type of error this is very simple okay so the first step is you need to go to uh, your install directory of xam okay in my scenario my xam is installed inside my c and inside the here you can see that the xam folder is showing okay so inside the xam okay so here we will go to the mysql folder okay this is the mysql folder and inside the mysql folder so here uh, we will fix this uh, issue okay so just follow my step the first step is you need to back up this data okay so for backing up this data first of all i rename it for example some uh, data old okay and i copy this folder this whole folder okay and uh, inside my desktop or anywhere i paste it okay i will show it to you why you are doing this okay so basically if, uh, we need to back up the data okay so basically we will play to the data folder so this is for the security purpose okay uh, so it, this approach is good so after copying the data to the desktop okay this is data old I again rename it to data okay and cut from here and similarly go to this mysql and here i paste this okay so now we have uh, we basically uh, we have our old uh, data okay so we back up it okay and the ori original data is this one okay so now inside the backup go to the backup and here copy all the file except the ib data one okay except this file will uh, copy all the files okay so not make it sure that not this okay if you copy this then you will delete your uh, all the databases so so therefore copy all the backup files except ib data okay leave this file and copy all others and go to this uh, data and inside the data paste all the files and replace in the destination after this if i again open the uh, XAMPP okay first you use uh, as you say that the error comes okay if I click on the mysql start here you can see that the status change is directed and XAMPP is running so it's successfully basically start running and the error is now removed so hope this video will help you a lot uh, if you have any question uh, regarding to uh, this topic Go to the video description link and you can ask your question in that specific link don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos stay blessed have a nice day